So guys, uh, now that everything's mocked up, it's time to take things apart, uh, fit everything better, and cut things. And But for now, I want to show you the first piece of cargo I got in the bed. Ow. So, in this box here, I have it already open because uh, when we ordered it, when it got delivered, uh, the guy must have like body slammed it on the um, porch, so we're checking it out. So I got a 125cc engine again, uh, but this time brand new, not a used one. Uh, but this one is different than the one we got from Bouncing Betty. This one has a, a three speed uh, and reverse, so it's still automatic though, but it has gears. So it, I, hopefully it's not under powder, powered because of all this uh, weight. So hopefully uh, it isn't underpowered, but if it is, eventually I'll uh, could do an engine about, or a, a video about an engine swap and get something bigger. So uh, we marked out uh, the fenders for the bed. We're actually going with uh, five inches instead of four because we want it to be more proportional to the bed. We notice on step side, you know, th well, this was almost the same length and we just want it to look normal. And then we also drew out a fender here to, for the uh, front fender. So I'm gonna have to cut this out and weld this back together and then get to mocking it on the, uh, this on the bed and mock this side for that side. This is the uh, rough cut of everything. Uh, we're gonna, we still gotta do some uh, like grinding and cutting here for tire clearance. And back there, we gotta move it and weld it. But for now, I just have it to, so you guys can kind of see what we're going with. Uh, this is, we're actually gonna move this like back here and have like the gap here and here kind of offset to look uh, like it all fits. So guys, uh, I uh, cut and measured everything up. So now it's time to extend the frame. So uh, I'm gonna have to cut here and here to be able to extend it so the bed could fit in the uh, wheel mount or wheel fenders will uh, cover the wheels. So I'm gonna get the cut. guys uh i want to apologize real quick for this video it is freezing so it's going to be spurts and randomness so i apologize for that but uh last time you saw i cut the frame i got this uh steel rod here or yeah steel and it's going to go in like like this as you see and i have it uh where i could still move it up and back and to figure out the uh the length that I want to get it at. 
So, let me put this one in to kind of get it. So as you see, I could still move it and adjust it because all up here is hollow. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna mock it up real quick to uh, figure out where it needs to be to have this looking right in the fender. Cause I wanna try to get it as proportional as possible. So I'm gonna mock it up real quick and then I'll get back to you guys. Uh, as you see, I extended the frame. I got it all mocked up, and I think this is where I like it best. I think it looks real proportional with this. So um, it, I'm going to take a little break on this because I have stuff coming in through the mail for it, and um, we still got to figure out some like other body parts and stuff like that. Just wanted to get the uh, frame extended to know where uh, everything needs to be, like in proportional wise so uh next week i'm going to have a video out but it's not going to be a go-kart video it's going to be a little something special for you guys so as always guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to like subscribe leave a comment and i hope you guys enjoyed your cruise down to lashman road